For weeks now, we've told you what is in the Arkansas Learns Act, that sprawling education bill proposed by Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders. The 144-page plan covers a wide range of topics, but some say there's important topics it doesn't address. Ian Russell speaks to people on all sides and has more now from the state capitol. While students are on their way to class at Maumelle Middle School, <laughs> Superintendent Dr. Charles McNulty has another subject on his mind. Obviously, just like other districts, we're anticipating um, a lot of information coming at us really fast. With the Learns Act, the 145-page omnibus education bill backed by the governor, signed by her pen Wednesday, McNulty is now awaiting a crash course of information as we head into next school year. It's set to law. Now we're going to have to see the rules and regs that will help guide school boards and, and our teams in the schools uh, to support all families and their children. But with so much packed into the act, the next question McNulty is studying is what wasn't included and he's not the only one. There wasn't enough input from stakeholders, um, even legislators. Nobody really knows how this is going to be implemented. Jessica Miller is a parent with kids in the Conway Public School System. To make a change this large that impacts so many families and so many schools and not know the first thing about how to implement it. That's unfair to the teachers. It's unfair to the school districts. This is definitely unfair to the students and the families. When I spoke with Arkansas Education Secretary Jacob Oliva Wednesday, he said there are still pieces and participants they're looking at when it comes to making this work. And the bill's sponsors told me they also think there are pieces that weren't included that could have been. As we focus on things like classified staff, as we focus on just the other uh, increases in budget, uh, th that's another great step that we're going to be taking in this legislative session. Back in Maumelle, McNulty admits there are our questions, but even so, all they can do is wait. It's hard again to to respond to that because again, we just have a framework, and then we're going to have to wait. And I'm I know that everybody's working hard, uh, and we appreciate that at the state level, but we're just going to have to wait and see uh, how the policies and regulations um, are unfolded. In Maumel, Ian Russell, Five News.